Good morning, sophomore Myers. I'm Chris. And I'm Alexis. And, and you're, you're watching, watching Wake Up, up Wolfpack. Pack. Less than a week before our first cap and gown deadline. Make sure you don't end up like Noah does in his dream. Order yours ASAP. I really can't wait to graduate. I've worked so hard. It'll be such a powerful day. Luan Rashidi. Walter Noah Gruner. Seniors, the deadline for caps and gowns is one week yesterday. If you get your money in by this deadline, you'll get a 100% refund if something doesn't fit or if you play games and can't graduate. The final deadline for caps and gowns for the class of 2023 is February 15th. Make it happen, seniors. Outstanding job by our Wolfpack JROTC program. The blood drive that they organized encouraged 64 students to sign up to donate blood. That's 32 liters of blood uh, to help save lives in our community. In turn, it also helps our student population. According to the Lieutenant Colonel Spurrier, the more blood donations during the school year, the more money Lee Health donates to the student scholarships for our seniors. Powerful work, JROTC. Thank you to the 64 of our students who signed up to donate. That's that's news, let's, let's send, send it, it to sports. sports. They don't like South. Welcome to the Sports Center, I'm Nevaeh. Powerful Wednesday for the Wolfpack Athletics Department. Let's start out at East Lee, where Coach Perez's girls weightlifting team. Some of them are moving on to regionals. Selena Santiago finished in first in Olympic results and traditional results. Emily Stoller also grabbed first in her division for traditional results. And both Jojo Ruiz and Zania Thomas have the potential to move on to regional competition on February 4th. Powerful work, ladies. On the road last night, our Wolfpack Wrestling Squad dominated the island Coast Skaters 65 to 12. Keep working hard, Wrestling Squad. Changing gears to the pitch, unfortunately last night marked the end of the road for our girls soccer squad. The ladies crossed the bridge and battled hard against Cape Coral. Special thank you to our powerful group of seniors that stuck with this program through thick and thin. Best of luck on your next journey. Sticking with soccer, good luck to our boys soccer squad. Coach Ford's group will host Island Coast tonight at 7 o'clock in the district quarterfinals. The guys finished the season on a high note with their largest margin of victory of the season their last time out. If you don't already go follow Wolfpack Football on Instagram, Ibriel Teneri Silva has been showcasing the Wolfpack's soccer skills and his video editing skills. Good luck tonight, gents. That's all we have for news. Have a powerful Wolfpack day. 